103.3 WJOD. Ken Piper, good afternoon. We've got a special in-studio guest with us. It is Laura Colby. Good afternoon, Laura. Good afternoon, Ken. Uh, you are with Crawford Cares. For folks that don't know what Crawford Cares is, why don't you give us just a quick intro to the program? Certainly. Crawford Cares is a program to give back to the greater Dubuque area and to make a positive impact on our local nonprofits. I'm with Crawford Company North in Dubuque. And this is our second year of having this program to honor the nonprofits that do so much for the area. Well, and you know what? Nonprofits are a huge part of the community, and they do an awful lot. A lot of the stuff, even behind the scenes, you don't even know about, but a lot of the stuff that, you know, that we do see. And it's great that uh, your company is willing to get out there and uh, create a program like Crawford Cares to help these folks out. Well, thank you. We like to think that we're, we're helping the community as a whole, and it's helping us to put down roots and become a part of Dubuque as a company ourselves. Well, we appreciate that. And I know you've been taking nominations over the last couple of weeks. Can we officially announced the uh, 2015 winner? I would like to say that this year we had 30 nominations. That's up from 12 last year. So certainly the people that have you heard behind your nonprofits. And that said, the winner this year was Tri-State Share. They're an organization that helps folks that have lost babies, either from a miscarriage, stillbirth, or an infant that was lost early on. Um, and they help people with um, grieving. They have a lending library, and they have a support network for those folks. And what did uh, Dubuque Tri-State Share end up with from Crawford Cares? They had a big giant check that you can't certainly put through the drive through They got a $1,000 prize that they can do with whatever they want to help folks out, and they also got an award that they can put on a shelf. Well, that is awesome. Thanks for what you do, and I assume we're going to do the program again next year? We most certainly are, Ken. And uh, how can people get involved? How can they find out more information? If you hit us up on our Facebook page, that'll have the information. Crawford North. Um, we also have a web page that they can um, look at that information for next year and certainly we invite people if they want to come by or send us an email or whatever for suggestions we'd be more than happy to take those into account for next year. Well sounds great. It's great to meet you Laura and thanks for uh, what you and Crawford Cares are doing for the nonprofits here in the Dubuque Tri-State area. Thank you Ken. 103.3 WJOD.